Europe, the third most populated continent in the world, only behind Asia and Africa, yet the second smallest continent by landmass, only larger than Australasia. Now, everyone has heard of the likes of France, Italy and Spain. They attract millions of tourists from around the world every year. So in this video, we'll give you our top seven underrated, underappreciated countries in Europe, in no particular order. So sit back, relax and enjoy. So first we start off with Latvia. Latvia is at the center of the Baltic states and is an exciting destination that offers something a little bit different as compared to many better known destinations. You can have an exploration in the beautiful Gauja Valley Pines, see small villages lost in the depths of time and people with a range of unique cultural practices. For something a bit faster paced, you can head to the modern yet historic capital of Riga, which is known for its amazing nightlife. Latvia has a strong and fascinating cultural identity, which makes it the perfect destination for those looking for somewhere new. Next, we have Iceland. Who hasn't heard of Iceland? I found it actually very surprising that it's one of the least visited countries in Europe, given its paradise-like state. It has dramatic hot springs, geothermal spas, glaciers, geysers, waterfalls, and black sand beaches. This is an absolute traveler's must visit. Now, the biggest downside of Iceland is that it is very expensive indeed. However, just like any country, it depends on your spending habits. With the bare minimum here, you could survive on 50 to $60 per day. Iceland gets around 800,000 tourists a year, and the biggest tourist hotspots are the Blue Lagoon, the Golden Circle, the Black Sand Beaches, and the capital of Reykjavik. And next on the list is Austria. If you're a sucker for serious beauty, then Austria needs to be on your travel bucket list. Visit this central European country and you'll be met with a sea of charming villages, dramatic landscape that will bring you to your knees, and of course, the fantastic city of Vienna. Vienna is all about culture, even after all of these years. Visit not just to sample a hearty Austrian fair, but also to attend concerts, art, be humbled by the amazing architecture. It's easy to feel like you've landed in the 16th or 17th century, spending an evening in this amazing city. And next up is Bulgaria. You can choose from dipping your toes in the Black Sea to running through the fields upon fields of golden sunflowers. Bulgaria offers some of the most stunning landscapes in Europe, if not the world. Because of its affordable prices in Europe, Bulgaria is a perfect spot for a weekend getaway or even a week's holiday. Beyond the beautiful beaches, you can head to the northwest region of Bulgaria to see the Flintstones in real life. Seriously, check out these rock formations. They look like something straight out of a cartoon. And next we have Slovenia. Fall in love with Slovenia's quaint small towns, beautiful vineyards, castles, and super friendly locals. With all its graciousness, you must one day stumble upon this gorgeous country and inhale all of its positive energy. Slovenia's most iconic tourist destination is Lake Bled, where you'll find a chapel on an island which gives it a dramatic fairy tale feeling. This is by far one of the most underrated countries in Europe. It is gaining a lot of attention lately. It's only a matter of time before the whole world starts raving about Slovenia. And next up, we have Scotland. When you think of traveling to the UK, most people imagine visiting London and perhaps a couple of other cities such as Cambridge or Oxford. However, Scotland is often overlooked, and we think it shouldn't be. Made up of hundreds of miles of rugged wilderness, scattered with historic cities, quaint towns, and magnificent monuments, Scotland has its own unique charm. There's more to Scotland than you might already know, and we're here to uncover the country's secret side. It has white beaches, awesome skiing trails, awesome mountain biking spots, and fantastic old cities such as Glasgow and Edinburgh. Perfect for a city break, or a weekend away. Scotland's beautiful scenery with towns full of character are fascinating, which makes it a must-see destination. With a seemingly unlimited number of things to do here, Scotland makes the perfect destination for a weekend away or for someone who's traveling internationally. And finally, last but not least, we have Croatia. Croatia has gained a lot of popularity over the last few years due to it being the set for Game of Thrones and hosting many electronic dance festivals such as Sona, hideout and outlook. It's also known for its beautiful beaches. They mostly include crystal clear water, hidden coves and rocks with plenty of olive trees, which in my opinion sounds fantastic. There are also countless fun activities such as diving, snorkeling, sailing, boating and yachting. You can do all of this while staring at those fantastic, gorgeous beaches. So, do you agree with our list? Do you think these countries are underrated? 
perhaps you live in one, let us know in the comment section below. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you in the next one.